A fishmonger from North London who's been smoking fish for decades has been told his business is too smoky. John Perkins has a smokehouse out the back of his shop in Crouch End, but after a complaint from a neighbour, the local council temporarily closed it down. Aisha Buksh has the story. There are only four smokehouses left in London, and this is one of them. John Perkins and his family have been smoking fish in it for decades, and it's still going strong. It's put sawdust in the bottom of the smokehouse, it's lit, and it just smoulders away until the haddock and the herrings there are flavoured, and that's it. In fact, there's been a fishmonger on Crouch End Broadway for over a century, and as these pictures show, naturally smoked fish was always a speciality. But before Christmas, the smoke was put out. After a complaint from a neighbour, the local council came and made a visit and decided that the smokehouse was in breach of the Clean Air Act and closed it down. We've been working for two and a half months now to try and get this sorted out and it's time that the bureaucracy was simply cut through and John was granted an exemption and allowed to carry on without all this stress and worry. The shop stayed open but the smokehouse was forced to close. It attracted huge support from locals, even a charity headed by Prince Charles took an interest. And now it's back in use again after negotiations with Haringey Council, although John's had to reduce its hours, which means production is down. It will have a large impact because obviously it's a niche product. People come to us purely for the naturally smoked fish. Um, it's obviously no chemicals, no additives, and that's what it's there for. So if we lose that percentage of our business, it, it makes it very difficult. Would the smell bother you if it was on your doorstep, though? Well, probably, to be perfectly honest, but... It's, you know, for the uh, pleasure of having a fish fish wrangler on the high street, I'd rather it was there. I guess it just depended on, on how strong the smell was. But, I mean, it's fantastic to have a local, a local fishmonger. <laughs> I like it. It's cool. It's just like an you know, independent shop. If they want to make a bit of a smell, it's fine. And you wanted two to out as well? Haringey Council told BBC London they were simply enforcing a law set by the government. John must now wait to hear from the Department for Environment to see if his smokehouse can get an exemption. Aisha Baksh, BBC London.